Oh, we need to first download the file from realvnc.com. Go down to the download section. We're going to get the free edition. And there's two files to choose from. There's one zipped and there's one just uh, raw executable. It doesn't matter which one you get. They're both pretty small. So just download the thing, run it right away. And it starts installing. Just use all the default, just next, 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 all the way through. Uh, you can create a shortcut if you'd like. When it gets to the password, we're going to create a pretty good password. Because this is going to be publicly accessible. So we want to create a really good password. Now we need to find out what the IP address is of, of the local machine that we're connecting to. So we're going to go start, run, type CMD, then type IP config, hit enter, and you'll see your local IP address there. Once you have the local IP address, then we can go into the router and configure that to point whatever traffic comes in on port 5900 will come through to this machine. So we go to the Applications and Gaming on Linksys because that's where you do port forwarding. Save the settings. And now we need to find out what the public IP address is so we know what to connect to when we're uh, outside the office or the home. So type in myipaddress.com, you have the IP address right there. And that's exactly what you're going to type in the VNC client program when you're outside on vacation or, or wherever.